The Muslim Consumers Association Malaysia, PPIM, has urged the relevant agencies to review the conditions and terms used in Islamic banking which allegedly oppress consumers. Its chief activist, Datuk Nazim Johan, said there were claims the principles in Islamic banking contravened Islam, exposing it to ridicule. Datuk Nadzim said PPIM has received some 4,000 complaints since 2003 of house buyers being forced to service their Islamic housing loans, although the projects were abandoned. Pinjaman daripada 200 ribu bila tidak dibayar di rumah di lelong dan loan menjadi 600 ribu. Kita these are questionable practices sebenarnya. Uh, unearned profit dan macam mana apa formula yang dipakai pakai yang menyebabkan ini satu kezaliman yang amat melampau he said there are four main principles which must be present in Islamic banking, namely no oppression, no element of excessive profit, not taking profit through manipulation and no injustice, while its aim is to help people who are in difficulty, oppressed or burdened with debts. He said in fact it is a principle of Islam to help those suffering from debts.